Hello everybody and welcome to Date Alive 3 episode 10 anime review. The uh you're going to be a, you probably might be a bit confused because I was because man the old switching the world lines and not knowing what happened before. Yeah. Yeah, time travel. They're not going to do it again. I think they're done with it for now. We just got to learn what happened in this world and then we'll be good. So uh, yep, you managed to change the, the new world line. He still saved all the spirits. Origami isn't in their class slash school. And uh, yeah, so for whatever reason, they di she didn't stay in the city at the school because he saved the parents. So then he's all sad because, oh, my friend. So the lolly squad tries to cheer him up. The lolly squad being Yoshino, uh, Natsumi, and Kotori. And uh, then Natsumi makes them all bigger and bustier, which was a sight. Let's just say a sight. It was a bit weird. It was kind of like, it makes sense, obviously. But it was still a bit weird to see, because they're lollies. But anyway. Uh, then we find out about Devil, and it's origami. You know, no surprise. They're just like, hey, look, here it is a picture. Well, let's just say it's an, unident I don't, uh, the pair. It's an unidentified spirit. But then they show a picture. I'm like, well, then you've identified it. Clearly. Like, you have access to the, like, people records, right? Surely. Whatever. But, uh, yeah, then the next day, they get a transfer student, and it's Origami. And she has long hair now. And she's, like, kawaii. I don't know how to explain it. She's, like, soft-spoken and really nice. And that was, that was weird. The long hair threw me off immediately. Like, I didn't notice it in the photograph. When she showed up with long hair, I was like, what? What are you doing? What's going on? What's happening? So that was wild. Uh, and she recognizes him from when he died. Died. Uh, you know, in the fire. What actually happened there? Because obviously, he, I don't think he died. But, or maybe he did. What happened? What happened to him? At, or did he just jump back? No, he must have just jumped at that. I assume that's what happened. He like went back in time before it hit him, so he didn't die or something. But then uh, they go talk on the roof at lunch, and uh, there's a lot of stuff that happened there. Uh, she does remember him. She, he like plays it off like it was his brother that saved her parents, so she thanks him for that. Uh, her parents died in a car accident like a year later, so it's like okay, you you bought them some time, but world line convergence or all that. It's basically just Steins Gate. Of just with magical pat well chaos head anyway uh da, da, da. then he asks straight up about the ast and then she basically now she wants revenge or not revenge she wants like i guess revenge for for him now instead of her parents so he just like shifted the target and then he asks about her becoming a spirit and she has no idea what he's on about she's like what i didn't become a spirit what are you on about and uh yeah then he has a sleep on the roof kurumi finds him and she she also remembers the other world line, so that they're the only two people that remember, unless more people remember. Are they going to fuse everyone's memories of the worlds? Because that would be really convenient. But maybe, 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 I don't think they'll do that. I think we're just going to have to deal. But uh, yeah, then they're talking, and uh, Orig Origami shows up, sees Kurumi, who is transformed because she's going to shoot the memory bullet to find out what's going on. And then she sees, and then her eyes go all like, they like lose the life out of them. And then she goes spirit, and then uh, kills Kurumi, kills a clone probably. And then uh, she goes back to normal after that, doesn't remember being a spirit. So like, also like, when she turns into like her spirit armor, her clothes like got burst off, but then they were back afterwards. So that's some, um, it's pretty powerful. That was the episode anyway. Like, I like this version of Origami more than the other one. Oh, and he's got a date with her on Saturday. I didn't mention that. So that's going to be the the ceiling date, I reckon. I don't know what day today was. Like, today in law time. But yeah, I imagine that'll be the ceiling date. We've only got two episodes left. Yeah, this has got to be the last arc. Well, obviously, that's two episodes left. I wonder if we're going to have a big old fight. Or if we're going to just seal and be done. Although this origami doesn't... Oh, that's, that's what I was wondering, how they're going to get around it. Because original origami loved him already. But this origami's just met him for the first time. Well, first time. So that's how they're going to get away. I get away with it. M extend it basically to make the date have meaning. I'm confused. Maybe the AST are going to attack her because she's a spirit. 
and she, he, he's going to protect her and she'll be like, oh, blushy, blushy. Maybe. I don't know, really. That's honestly where I'm at. So, uh, yeah, let me know what you guys thought and stuff, and I will see you next week. Bye-bye.